Well, welcome to Ubuntu. As you notice, when you first logged in, you get purple. Everything in it is mostly purple. So when you first get it, you'll notice it looks like the Mac, and you're used to the Star button on Windows 7 at the bottom left, but it's an icon that says Show the Desktop. Well, now it's at the top left for at your applications, places for your documents and pictures, and system. So it's not like the Start menu on Windows 7 or Windows Vista slash Mac. So um, when you op go to places and you open up documents, you will notice that the exit button and the icons appear at the left. There's a way to put it on the right, so I'll show that later on. But first, I will be showing customization and making your visual effects like I showed in the first part of the video of part one. So um, you'll notice there's no wobbly windows. So to enable that, simply right click on your desktop, click on change desktop background, click on visual effects, and click extra. A window should pop up asking use previous settings or use the original settings. Just use the settings now. Now, when you move your windows, it's wobbly, and you have your effects when you close windows. Uh, when you enable it, uh, after that's done, go to System, Preferences, and then Keyboard Shortcuts. After you click on Keyboard Shortcuts, you should see this. Just simply scroll down until you see Run a Terminal. terminal. Click on it and press Control alt delete a window should pop up asking to reassign click on reassign after that's done you should see expo key if you scroll down a little bit more click on expo key and press F1 so what that does is when you press F1 you have separated windows let's say I have pictures I simply click I mean press shift control alt on the keyboard and use the keypad on the keyboard to move it to side to side so when I press F1 I can organize my windows and whatever I want on each side. So let's say you have a video here, you have a picture there. Okay, once you get your keyboard shortcuts done, let me just close these. Now we are about to download Compiz, which enables the desktop cube and your special effects. So first we will download Compiz. So um, first, of, first of all, go to Applications, Ubuntu Software Center. Once you open up Ubuntu Software Center, um, type up here Compiz. After you click on that, you should see Advanced Desktop Effects Settings. So when you see that, just click on Install, which should be on the right, and Simple Compass Configuration Settings Manager, click Install. So once you install both of them, first go to System, I mean, I'll close a bunch of Software Center, open up System, Administration, and then Synaptic Package Manager. Something will pop up asking for your password. Just type in your password. After Synaptic Package Manager is open, you'll notice you'll see an arrow over here. Click on that and click on Search. After you see that, type in the search bar Compiz. So after it loads Compiz, scroll down until you see Compiz Fusion Plugins Extra. Uh, that box next to it, check mark it, mark for installation, and click Mark. One second. Mark for installation and then click apply and Windows should pop up asking to apply again and then click apply over here and it says downloading package files and just wait for that to be done downloading after it's done downloading it should say installing software so just let it install its and do its thing after that this one should say changes applied click close close synaptic package manager go to system preferences and then simple compass configuration settings manager after that's done you should get a window like this where it says profiles change this to ultimate go to click the animations tab check around the box that says enable extra animations now when you do that click on open window change it to random close window to random focus window to fade and minimize window to random now after that's done, open up a window or, or a folder like documents. When it opens it has its effects. So if I minimize it, it does its own effects which is pretty much fun that you can do. After that's done, click on effects. After you click on effects you'll notice switcher. Switcher is the alt tab on your keyboard. So when I do alt tab it gives me a visualized switching like on Windows 7 when you press super tab. So it's customizable on Ubuntu so if you go to under switcher and you choose flip that's going to be flipped so when I do this it does flip if I do ring switcher it will do the ring switcher so I'll just wait for this and does this instead so that's fun but to me I like flip 
After you get that done, click on Desktop tab, change the appearance to Desktop Cube, set the Desktop Columns to 4 and the Desktop Rows to 1. After that's done, click on Accessibility and press screen, click on Screen Zoom. Now go back to Desktop and once you have Desktop Cube, you're wondering how do I do Desktop Cube. Well, it's an alternate from the Expo, so when I press Control, Alt, and left click on your key, your uh, mouse, it will give you the cube. When you move up, it goes up, you go down, it goes down, vice versa. So when you go up, you'll notice an image. Well, you can change that into whatever picture you want, so I will show that later in this video. So after you get that all done, you have your effects. Now, second, we will be installing a dock at the bottom of your screen, which will look like what I showed.